the all-new Toyota Innova, SUV-like, with a hybrid version. Toyota Innova 2023. The car has been changed in appearance, interior and has a 2.0L hybrid engine. In the latest version, Innova presents a significant difference from its predecessors in many aspects. While previous versions of this popular MPV model were built on the IMV ladder chassis also used by Hilux and Fortuner, the latest Innova switched to a monolithic structure based on Toyota's new global architecture, TNGA, specifically the GAC variant. Thus, the engine is placed vertically, driving the rear wheels is no longer available, instead there is a horizontal engine and front-wheel drive. According to Toyota, the new platform allows to reduce the car's overhang and lengthen the wheelbase. The current wheelbase is 2,850 mm, compared to 2,750 mm before. Other dimensions include a length of 4,755 mm, plus 20 mm, and a width of 1,850 mm, plus 20 mm, while the height remains unchanged at 1,795 mm. Toyota decided to maintain the same approach and exit angles of the second-generation model, while also having a ground clearance of 185 mm. Inside, the new panel has a more elegant look than the previous swipes and curves. Contrasting trim colors accentuate the layers of the dashboard, with the centerpiece being the floating center console integrated with the center stack. This area contains the gear lever, digital control buttons for the air conditioning system, central air vents and a 9 tenths inch touchscreen infotainment system. The Innova boasts more interior space than before. As for other available equipment, the Innova can have 16 to 18 inch wheels, LED headlights, electronic parking brake with auto hold, 10 inch rear seat entertainment screen. The panoramic and special sunroof includes driver assistance and safety systems. The all-new Innova features a dynamic force engine, M20A, FXS 2.0 naturally aspirated four-cylinder, delivering 152 horsepower at 6,000 RPM and 187 Newton meters of torque, from 4,400 to 5,200 RPM. This is boosted by an electric motor rated at 113 PS and 205 Newton meters. For a total system output of 186 PS, Toyota says nickel metal hydride NIMH. Batteries are preferred due to Indonesia's hot weather, and they are stored under the two front seats so they don't take up space in the cabin and rear trunk. Besides the hybrid powertrain, the Innova will also be offered in Indonesia with a 2.0-liter M20A FKS engine that produces 174 horsepower at 6,600 rpm and 205 newton meters of peak torque from 4,500 to 4,900 rpm. Both setups also have a CVT eCVT for hybrid transmission and have more power than the current 2.0 liter 1TR FE engine that makes 139 horsepower and 183 newton meters of torque. This new generation Innova is also available with the 2.4 liter 2GD FTV turbo diesel engine in Indonesia, which offers more torque at 360 newton meters and lower horsepower at 149 PS. But there is no option for oil engine. Toyota Innova 2023 has five main versions, 2.0G, 2.0G HV, 2.0V, 2.0V HV, and 2.0Q HV. Prices range from 26,670 to 39,080 US dollars. Toyota Indonesia welcomes the arrival of the Kijang Innova Generation 7 Xenix, produced by PT. Toyota Motor Manufacturing Indonesia, TM Lian, in Karawang, West Java, Monday, November 21, 2022. Swallowing an investment of 4.2 trillion rupiah, Kijang Innova also presents a choice of hybrid electric vehicle, HEV, electrification vehicles with locally assembled batteries. The local production of the Kijang Innova Xenix reflects its position, which has grown and developed together with the Indonesian automotive industry and consumers for 45 years until now entering the electrification era.
The Kijang Innova Xenix, which absorbs around 1,000 new workers, was developed by a global team together with Indonesian engineers who actively and integrally contribute at every stage of development, including in the production line. This is in accordance with Toyota Indonesia's philosophy of we make people before we make products, which is the basis for the sustainable development of human resources at Toyota Indonesia and at Toyota, Indonesia's local suppliers. Notably, the new Toyota Innova has the Toyota Safety Sense Safety Package with a series of advanced driver assistance technologies, such as lane departure warning, point warning, 360-degree camera. Equipped with a global, Toyota new global architecture, platform that provides driving comfort and pleasure and is supported by the latest TSS3 safety technology, consisting of pre-collision system, dynamic radar cruise control, lane departure alert, lane tracing alert, and automatic high beam, as well as the latest generation 5 hybrid system. The Innova was created by 120 local engineers, who are equipped with a variety of expertise that aims to create global quality human resources to produce standardized products and manufacturing processes globally, and supported by qualified local supplier human resources. Toyota Indonesia believes that the transformation of the automotive industry can still optimize local capabilities by increasing HR capabilities and implementing technological advances, according to the challenges of the electrification era in its production process. Therefore, Toyota Indonesia cooperates with the world of education to jointly disseminate knowledge about electrification, such as with universities through collaborative research and a series of national seminars. Toyota Indonesia also established the ZEV Center which is a learning, capability and research facility for electrification technology, green energy and mobility as a means for Indonesian HR to deepen their understanding of technology and the future ecosystem of the automotive industry.